Water, too, is something she's always cherished. She grew up as the youngest of five children, all top swimmers. A motorcycle accident in 1991 changed Kirsten's life. Diagnosis, paraplegia. However, her passion for the water remained. Kirsten Broon simply loves the feeling of weightlessness far too much. And so she began to return to competitive swimming in 2002. This sport gives me an incredible quality of life and a great boost to my ego from the successes I've now managed to achieve. That does me a lot of good. It simply feels good, too, to finish first. Athens 2004. At the Paralympic Games, she won four medals, including gold in the 100 meters breaststroke, her top discipline. The most emotional moment of her career, however, came a short while later. And then everyone was standing up and the anthem began and I thought to myself, they're all standing for you and sharing in your delight. You've achieved here what you never thought you'd be able to do in all your life and I certainly had to fight to maintain my composure. The past is something she's accepted. She thus lives in the here and now, achieving the incredible. Like jumping from the starting block, despite paraplegia. After six months of hard work came the reward, a life-changing moment. And then when the whistle came and I jumped and I noticed that it really was a jump, a really dynamic jump that made me really glide through the water, I realized right away, that will give you at least a second. At which point I said to myself, that's it, you're back to your old self. You can do it again and there's nothing that isn't possible somehow. Everything is possible. And so she trains day after day. Dry training at home for at least two hours. With enormous concentration and self-discipline, she's pursuing her major target, the Paralympic Games in Beijing. She, after all, does not dream her life away. She lives her dream.